Hi guys, welcome to my channel and today in this video I'm going to show you how you can connect your line mixer to your laptop and you can go live on Facebook or on YouTube or on anything. So guys, for the full video, all of you stay tuned. Karen Jeffrey live. So guys, uh, to connect your line mixer to your laptop and to go live or to record your performance, so what are the things we need? first and the most important thing we need line mixer so guys my this line mixer it can directly connect to the laptop also but most of the viewers were asking me like their line mixer is not digital so they have the old traditional line mixer how they can connect it with the laptop so in this video i'm going to show you how we can do it so guys what you need is this is the most important piece you need for this setup so now i'll be connecting the line mixer to my laptop using the type c but in the laptop you have normal usb ports also even those can be used but if you are using the if your laptop does not have type c connection okay so then what you need is you need a sound card okay so on one side it will have this 3.5 mm slot on the other side it will have this usb normal usb interface okay so i will leave the link of the sound hub from where to buy the sound card in the description so i'll be connecting this line mixer to my laptop type c port so i'm using this type of sound card so on one side it has this type c interface on other, another side it has this female 3.5 mm jack okay so this is the most important cable you need so next thing what you need is you need to connect your uh, another laptop or your mobile phone or your tablet okay from where you can get the sound or something for that i'll be using this rca2 to 3.5 mm cable so this rca2 will go as an input to my mixer and this will go to my tablet okay the tablet can be replaced with another mobile phone it can be replaced with another laptop or anything where you want to play from where you want to play the music okay and third cable which we need what we need is rca2 to trrs cable so guys what is trrs rrs cable so there you see you have these three rings you have this three rings and in normal 3.5 mm jack you can see the number of rings are two and here the number of rings are three so i'm keeping both of them together for your knowledge so one two and three so guys this is very important in case you are using this type of converter why because this will only work with the trrs cable so many try to plug in the normal 3.5 mm jack here it will not work so very important you need this rca2 to trrs cable okay so guys these are the things which we need okay so now and i'll be also connecting my condenser mic okay which is here to this line mixer so i will speak in the mic i will play the music from my tablet and all of them will get mixed up here in the mixer and the output will be going to my laptop okay which i can record or i can use it to go live on any app like youtube or uh, even for the google meet also i can use this same setup so guys now let us start so first thing what i'll do is i'll connect my condenser mic i will connect my condenser mic to the mixer so guys this is the xlr cable which comes from this condenser mic so and guys here my mixer is off so this is very important while you are doing the connections so you turn off your mixer so it goes here okay my condenser mic connected so when i turn on the after i turn on my mixer i will also turn on the 48 vo volt phantom power so which will power my condenser mic so now i move it on the side so the next thing is i will connect my tablet to the mixer so so this cable i'll be using okay so rca2 so red goes in red white goes in white and other side goes in the 3.5 mm slot of my 
tablet so tablet also connected i'll keep it here on this side okay now guys what we want is we want to connect this output okay to the laptop okay so here is the output so guys i am using my old handy cam cable i had it in my home so i always use it so the only thing is in handy cam cable cable you have this yellow thing for the video which i won't be using so again left and right so this is the output from the mixer and left and right and guys the other edge of this cable the trrs cable edge will go to my sound card like this okay now and this will this c type will go to my laptops c type okay so again if you do not have c type in your laptop you can use normal usb sound card okay here we go and guys this cable connections are complete okay so now we will switch on the mixer i will do some basic settings of the mixer how we can set up our mixer for that i have another video the link of that video also i will leave in the description section so let us turn the mixer on so guys very important when you switch it on set all the outputs to zero okay so guys now my mixer is also on i will engage the phantom power so guys just for your reference so here on the mixer i have a jack for the headphones here i will connect external speaker so that you can listen to the sound which my mixer is producing so i'll be connecting my this external speaker to the mixer okay Audio. Okay, so now I engaged the phantom power. So let me increase the gain a little, and I'll speak in my. See, I'm speaking in my condenser mic, and you can see the peak is coming. Now let us increase the volume. See, now I'm tapping my mic, and you can hear the sound from the speaker. So guys. no same audio whatever i am speaking will go to my laptop okay so and whatever i play from my tab okay will also come from the speaker suppose i play this now you can see i am speaking and the background sound is coming from my tab and both the sounds are getting mixed up here and we are going to the speaker so guys same setup you can do for live performance also okay now the next part so guys now you can see so this is my line mixer and here is the output which comes from the line mixer and which goes to my this sound card and my sound card is connected to the c type usb port of my laptop okay and whatever i speak the sound comes from the speaker and same sound will go to the laptop okay so now the next part so what are the settings which i need to do on my laptop so guys very important on my laptop i have to go to my audio settings okay or to my sound settings okay like this and here on the sound settings okay so what i have to do is so i have to go to the sound okay and see by default now the mic is usb already it is selected okay so here this is the most important setting so the input and output both you have to you select as usb okay now we are good to go now we are good to go so guys now whatever we speak okay whatever i speak will in the mic will be recorded on my laptop okay so just for an example so let me open my sound recorder okay so in the sound recorder like if i speak anything on my mic okay so you can hear the sound from the speaker for your reference which is here hello okay whatever i speak or whatever i play will be recorded on the computer okay so let us play something 
on the tab and let me speak something so this is my tab okay i start the sound recorder i play the music and i am speaking something so my voice is getting mixed up in the mixer and it is going to the computer okay so let us stop it now let us play what we recorded i play, I play the music and i am speaking something so my voice is getting mixed up in the mixer and it is going to the computer okay so let us stop it okay so guys i hope you understand up to here okay Uh, so guys now let us try to go live using this setup so here i click on create and i go live so here i'll give a title that is live setup test so next next done so because of network speed it is taking some time and let us go live so guys here if you can see little up now my webcam is also active and you can see me you can see my camera you can see my mic and we are live so we are live using this mixer okay and you can see the condenser mic also okay and we are live and guys this is how we do it okay so let me play some background music okay so guys now you can see i'm talking the music is playing so this setup can be used for anything for your live performance for your meetings or to go live on youtube tiktok any app you prefer So guys in the next part of this video you I, I will append the live session so that you can see how it was live okay so when i went live using this setup okay and i will also leave the link of the live uh, streaming in the description of this video so also and, and you can, can see me you, you can, can see, see my, my camera, camera you can, can see, see my mic, mic and, and we are live, live. So, so we are live, live using, using this mixer, mixer okay, okay and you, you can, can see the condenser, the condenser mic also okay, okay and, and we are live and, and guys this is how we do it okay, okay. So, so let, let me play, play some background, background music. music okay so, so guys, guys now you can see i'm talking and the music is playing so this setup can be used for anything for your live performance for your meetings or to do live on youtube tiktok any app you prefer so guys that's all for today okay and i will also leave the link of this live telecast in the video description section so guys that's all for today and if you like my videos please subscribe to my channel i'll be uploading more how to do stuff to home studio setups and all kind of things so guys all of you thanks for watching and stay tuned